As I warned, Nostradamus-like, after Spider-Man recklessly took down Wilson and Fisk without preparing for the consequences, our streets are now filled with aspiring gangsters, each trying to out-psycho the other. My next guest is lucky to have survived an armed robbery. Sir, we're glad you're okay. Thanks. It was nuts. These dudes walk in like they own the place, waving guns around. Appalling. When a businessman is afraid to make an honest living. Yeah, it was a lifesaver that Spider-Man came along and stopped him. Weren't you listening? He caused the problem! I didn't... Forgive me for raising my voice. I'm emotional at the thought of what you went through. Jared, our caller seems shaken. Let's let him go. I'm fine. Goodbye! that shot. Units be advised, a kidnapping was just reported. Incident is active near Estonia. Yuri sits quietly. Better find a back way in.
I am losing patience. Where is the file? There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? There's no one here but us. We will find the file. Or you will die. This is bad. They'll kill her if I alert them. Need to pick them off silently. Yuri, the silent alarm was legit. Masked gunmen and a single hostage. Looks like a heist in progress. Copy that. Sending units your way. Keep the situation from getting worse in the meantime. Can do. Gotta do this quietly. Don't want to alert the others. They always look so cozy webbed up like that. Should web him from above. Careful. You stay quiet now. Someone's coming. My patience wears thin. Someone else is here. I swear. They must have the file. If they're here, where are they? Hey, what is that? This totally belongs to- Don't move! Buddy, if I had a nickel for every don't move... Hey, Pete. MJ? What are you doing here? Same as you. Working. At least, I was. Oh, I, uh, think this is yours. Yeah, thanks. So, Robbie's got you covering a break-in for the Bugle? Well, Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here. And it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago. Uh, uh-huh. Let me explain. Excuse me. Hi, Mary Jane Watson. I am covering the Fisk estate sale. Hello. Craig said we'd do this tomorrow. I like to get a jump on things. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry. It just... It looks like we're gonna have to run something else on the cover. I don't know, uh, maybe the expressionist piece? You know what? I think I can make today work. Are you sure? You're here, no moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? Never mind, we're good. Let's get started. Look around and familiarize yourself with the items. I'll be waiting by the Baku statue when you're ready to begin. Can do. This cut Peter open like a pork sausage with this the first time they fought. 
Pete got away, collapsed in my yard half dead, and I had to steal my dad's car to drive him to the ER. The first Sometimes I feel like the whole history of the world is just boys playing dress up, getting into fights. Let me know when you're ready to begin. Sounds good. Starting with the prize, a one-of-a-kind Kake Monbaku. Oh, beautiful. It's a Mifune? Correct. Mr. Fisk has exceptional taste. Did you know him well before his arrest? In a professional context. I handled many of his sales. Let's move on, please. Now this exquisite piece exemplifies the traditional Tarashikomi puddled ink effect. The two Neo are so imposing. I can see why Fisk liked this piece. Definitely his style. He loved the duality. Destruction screams, but creation toils in silence. Was there ever anything irregular in any of the sales you handled for him? No. No, of, of course not. Not that I was aware of. Notice the intricate gold inlay on this ceremonial tea set. It's just... A friend in the DA's office mentioned that Fisk used art sales to launder stolen goods. I'm sure I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh, I know. I was just wondering, now that he's arrested, if you had ever noticed anything strange. You know what? I'm actually running short of time. Why don't we grab the cover photo while we can? When I told my DA friend I was doing a piece on you, he mentioned your name was familiar. Just the photo, please. Stand right there. Are you sure there's nothing you'd like to say, maybe off the record, regarding Fisk's activities? I don't think your readers would have any interest in... Damn it. Wait here, please. Can't go in now. She'll see... Wait. I recognize that statue. Gotta get a photo. That shouldn't be here. Hello? Craig? Craig, I'll call you back. My dear, I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine. Follow me. Thank you. This... this is a really lovely space. It is. And this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick. Of course. Be right back. Hello, Craig. Funny you should call. Because the reporter you sent is clearly not working the puff piece we agreed upon. No, she's here now. I've got to get into that back room. If that statue is what I think it is, this just turned into a huge story. What do you mean he had to reschedule? Quiet. If she's not your reporter, who is she, Craig? Who is in my auction house? Oh my god. No, I do not trust you to fix this. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is have Miss Investigative Journalist arrested. And the second thing I'm going to do is collect your head, Craig. Dang, she's pissed. It is most definitely a threat. Uh-huh. Sure, Craig. Right. I don't believe you. Uh-huh.
Sure, Craig. Right. I don't believe you. Uh-huh. Pete told me about this. Fisk used it to hide evidence. Why didn't the cops take it? I know this statue opens, but how? That's the Neo behind them, but it looks different. you can move. Most common pose is latent power. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. Hmm. Hmm. He's holding something. She certainly is cozy with Fisk. These pieces move. in one of his hands. What is that? The catalog mentioned two poses. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. Maybe I should turn the head. Excuse me, sir. You you can't be not good. Where's the statue? In in in, in there. Ba Wen Jin Zao Su Lai. I was on my way to the exit when I saw you. You're lucky to be alive. This is the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, whoever these masked guys are, they're after this file. But I'll never get it out of here while the place is swarming with them. Right. Okay. Um, you hide back there. I take out the bad guys. You make a break when it's clear. Sounds like a plan. Good to see you, Pete. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Funny. It's exactly how I pictured it. Did she change her perfume? 
focus, Pete, focus. No. Yes, all right, of course. Should clear these guys out before I push forward. Will do. How about that file? What's in it that these guys want so bad? Notes on something called Devil's Breath. Fisk was hired to build a secret research lab for it. I'm not clear what Devil's... There we go. The hostage taking guys. Whoa, what is up with that glowy stuff on your hands? Are you guys ghosts? Never fought a ghost before. I mean, I fought specters, but you know, technically, specters aren't ghosts. All ghosts are specters, but not all specters are ghosts. You know what I mean? Uh, seems like this is an energy thing, not a ghost thing. All good. Fight a ghost stays on the old bucket list. Yeah. Huh. Looks antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi. Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You... You will not write a word of what you saw For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That... I, I don't... What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Mix? <laughs> like the last six months never happened? Since when did Mix become Italian? 
have no idea, but I'm still glad he makes these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the Bugle? Mm. Well... Yeah, well, I just got an all-caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask, guys. What's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's, how's it going with you? Did, did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius' work will help millions. I'm, I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. A well, lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends. Is that what we are? Well, maybe we could be, you know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. down third. Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker! Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cut. Take. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from masked criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Doc, I make a point not to leave anything there, but I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. 
that buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep? Please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. Backup for a chase in progress. Please respond. Incident is active near Times Square. Proceed with caution. Those lunatics will kill someone driving like that. We recognize your authority. Your vehicle is unregistered. You have no license. <sighs> Young man, I will pull this car over right now. Now that's just rude. Give that real man props. Manhattan rush hour is no joke. All units be advised. Armed robbery in progress. Any officers in Nomad, please respond. Mugging reported. Need an officer on the scene. Officers needed in Gramercy. Please copy. Local units respond. We've got reports of a break-in. Mobilize on Dutchtown. Seriously? Give it up! You're never gonna catch me! That's what you said last time! I don't wanna hurt you! You'll just slow me down! Wow! That's considerate! What's the money for, Herman? Why do you care? Actually, I don't. Just trying to make polite conversation. I'm done talking! But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on it. Gotcha. Now let's talk. I said I'm done talking! Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate. Which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone. Or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. It's your choice. Not enough.
Sherman? You have like zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. It looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late? Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah. He was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Almost morning. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Peter! What can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Why take the risk? Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. I could patch these shoes. 
Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry, I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. I'm just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration is mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Ever. Empire State University. The old all blue. Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I didn't forget, forget, I just, I, I'll be there soon. His tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker, you're better than this. That's <sighs> right. How did I lose track of time? Available units need response to a break-in. Response needed north of Houston. That's a keeper. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. 
stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work in a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter. There's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. I wish I could do something to help Doc. Maybe call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. Should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. Must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. about these before you left me. Pete, hey, I need a favor. My mom's pet project was research stations that could benefit the public. Now, I launched them, but now that I'm away, Oscorp's gonna shut them down unless they prove their value. I was hoping you could watch them. I left details in each one. Thanks, man. As long as they're here, it's like a part of my mom is, too. Well, it's not gonna pay the bills, but... It sounds like it means a lot to him. I'll do what I can to help. I've got a couple stations measuring air pollution. The idea is to catch the, um, what's the word, contaminants, before they reach toxic levels. Between you and me, I think Oscorp wants this to fail because it might chill their polluting. 
the amount of polycyclic hydrocarbons in the air is way too high. And rising. If it keeps getting worse, people could die. Particles are concentrating in trouble spots, like mini clouds of smog. I'll swing through them and get sampled. Nasty as they are, I gotta swing right through those clouds. For these clouds to be visible to the naked eye, the level of toxins must be up there. Getting some good stuff. Well, good samples of bad stuff anyway. <laughs> Got it. Must be freaking these people out. Ah, what else is new? coming from two types of cars and a faulty smokestack. I better get photos. Great light on that one. Perfect. Smokestack picture I ever took. The Department of Environmental Protection will take it from here. Maybe I should make a green spider costume for Earth Day. Well, Harry Station just stopped the public health crisis. Roscorp's gonna have a hard time arguing it's not useful. Spider-Man, Shocker has escaped, and now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was. But one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Attention. 
Washington units, we've got reports of muggings in the area. Peter, I've been looking into the demons. Sounds like they've quietly established a power base in the vacuum left by Fisk. A vacuum I created by putting Fisk away? Jameson was right. The demons are my fault. What were you supposed to do? Let Fisk keep godfathering? Are you okay? You sound even mopier than usual. I think I might have just lost my job. Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Want to play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb us? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa! Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You want to fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me, so young and stupid? You just stupid! You talk so much! Well, that's a matter of... Okay, now I can do some real damage. Why are you doing this, Herman? Under my clothes! Don't kill me! Coming your way! If you come clean, I can help you! You really want to help me? Don't let me have the money! Sorry, not gonna happen. No, people don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found actual cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trade. It's all the rage. No! Oh, come on, Herman! Tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear. Catch! You're freaking me out, Herman. It's not like you to be afraid of people. Not even sure these guys are. These mad guys. What do they want the money for? No, no, don't care. Don't let that finish the job. I'm gone. Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I do! You son of a... Okay, last chance to give up! This time I really mean it! We're going! Gotcha! If you ask nice, okay, I was kidding before. Now is your last, last chance. Seriously. Sorry, Herman. Ah! You brought this on yourself. Literally.
was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on Demon... Uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. <laughs> 